dear students today i am going to give you the very very important questions which are related to the bca first year first semester web technology subject so please subscribe my channel anu computer education so in future whatever the videos i am going to make immediately i'll upload in my channel so you can access those videos so go in the next coming semester what are the computer subjects are there the complete subject related videos as per the university what are the syllabus is given that complete syllabus related videos i'm going to make and immediately i'll upload in my channel so once you subscribe immediately you'll get a notification regarding my new videos so here some important questions so bca first year first semester web technology uh, unit 1 what is write about the bomb and dom so you need to write about what is bomb and what is dom you need to write so the next question is what is table okay what is table how to create a table in html so you need to write about the table so you know already table is a collection of rows and columns in table can be created with table tag so table tag is having some sub tags are there one is body uh, one is uh, table heading okay tr and td table data so the, the complete concepts you have to explain along with one example program you have to write so for all whatever the programs you are writing in web technology or whatever the concepts you are getting complete the concept related okay example programs you have to explain so without writing the example program you cannot explain uh, expect the marks in web terminals okay so what is the presentation of web technology you know first you have to write up the definition so what are the tags which we are using for that so after that you have to take your own example and explain the that concept with the, your own program so that you need to do in every program so the next question is what is form so you know already in facebook or gmail whenever you want to open the account you need to create a uh, you need to uh, enter the details yes or no wherever you are entering the details are nothing but a forms now so form we have different types of form controls are there like radio button check boxes text boxes we have so many different types of form elements are there or form controls are, okay so form can be created with the form tag so you create one student registration form and uh, you explain the definition after that you write one own example program so now what is the meaning of id and element selector so you know what is the meaning of difference uh, selectors are there in okay id versus okay element so these are the unit 1 questions so when it is comes to the unit 1 uh, long answer two more questions are there what is list at different types of list with example so you know already list means what whenever you want to display any items uh, with like bullets okay so you know already list lists are three types of list are there order list or not a list as well as definition list so order list can be represented with oil tag and non order list can be represented with usual tag and definition list can be represented with a dl tag so you know already if you want to display any list of items by using the sequence then go for order list if you want to display any list of items by using uh, bullets called symbols okay then go for the unordered list whenever you want to write any definitions abbreviations then go for the definition list okay so all we have to explain with example so how to add a uh, image to the browser so what is image tag you have to explain about the image tag here and as well as what are the different types of attributes which are present for the image tag you know already image tag is having so many different types of attributes one is uh, alt title width height h space v space okay so width so so many different types of attributes are there all these attributes we have to explain in detail so with along with one example so short answers are what is www and web browser and web server so you have to write about all these things in links means hyper hyperlink concept you have to explain anchor tag a tag concept you have to explain linking one page with another page now you write one example program you explain this concept so when it is comes to the unit 2 what is css need of and benefits of css you know already what is the meaning of css cascading style sheet so why we are using css now whenever you want to okay uh, style the any html page so we need to use a concept of css so what is the benefit of css you know you can separate the html code with the css code so whatever whatever the changes you are doing in css program that will be uh, reflected in your all the html programs who are using the css file so that is the uh, beauty of css concept so that everything you have to explain now different types of css means you know already css is having so many types internal css external css and one is inline css so all these three topics you need to explain along with the example okay so in the next uh, please uh, subscribe my channel what i will do the whatever the important questions i'm giving maybe within a one or two days i'm going to make this all videos i'm going to upload in my channel so you can make use of so what is the meaning of selector you know we have so many different types of selectors are there id selector class selector element selector next to universal selector 
adjacent sibling selectors like so many different types of selectors are there so you can use any one of the selectors so you have to write about all the different types of selectors so write about the css styles so whenever you want like uh, changing the background color or background properties we have to write for font properties and uh, css table related properties and css list related properties you have to explain in detail so next when it is comes to the unit number 3 uh, what is what is uh, responsive web design okay and uh, how to create a responsive web design so these are very very important long answers from unit 3 and next uh, uh, responsive web design media queries next uh, its types so the next question is uh, rwd grid view so these are the unit 3 questions the last question in unit 3 is grid grid row and the grid column so these are very very important questions in unit 3 so when it is comes to the unit 4 what is javascript so you know why we are using javascript javascript is mainly used for what client side validation like email validation or password validations that we are going to do with the help of javascript so everything you have to explain in details next what is function you know already in javascript functions can be created with function uh, keyword so how to create a function in javascript that everything you have to explain so write about the different conditional control statements like if if else else if so switch that all you have to explain so different types of looping statements in javascript you know already this same topics you learn in c language also for loop while loop do while so all these loops you have to explain in detail so all these uh, concepts you have to write the definitions syntax one after that you can use any one of the looping statement example and you can write for the exam uh, example program so don't need, no no need of writing what all concept related example program just you can write all the definitions and uh, syntaxes after writing the syntaxes just you write one uh, example program for either any one of the loop for loop or while loop with the similarly the same topic you need to repeat for the uh, conditional control statement so all the conditional control statement definitions syntaxes after that you to use any one of the conditional control statement write down one example program so that is more than enough so what is operator you know already in say it's the same topic you learned in c language also but some of the operators which are differ from c language to html so that we have to write different types of same arithmetical logical all operators we have to write it now what is the string handling functions so you know trim function uh, string length function okay string concatenation so string reverse so string upper string lower so so many different types of operations which we can perform on the string so that all functions you have to explain so the very very important question from this unit is uh, what is event handling so mouse and keyboard events are very very important like on click on double click okay on blur okay so okay on mouse move on mouse out on key up on key down okay there are all this programs on key press on key release so all these concepts you have to explain so when it is comes to the unit 5 what is typescript and the next question is J, uh, jsx overview enums and next one is advanced types generics so these are very very important questions in okay web technologies please subscribe my channel anu computer education so in future whatever the videos i'm going to make immediately you'll get a notification regarding my new videos